hello everyone welcome back to our channel so good to have you guys back here again thank you once again for your continuous massive and huge support to this channel god bless you guys we really appreciate you and we pray that even as you support this channel god almighty will support you in whatsoever you lay your hands to do in jesus name amen yes my people we are back again with latest and most authentic happenings in the country we've got a shocking one right now Davido Blast Desmond Elliot says that uh, you've destroyed all the good memories you gave us in movies. Wow. We know um, Desmond Elliot um, is in support of uh, you know the, the restriction in the social media bill. They are trying to shut Nigerians up again. We know very well, but um, we know we, we won't give in to that. Anyways, let's uh, we'll get all the details of what Desmond Elliot actually stated that um, caused a lot of reactions a lot of people are talking about it we can see that even david do he just gave him his the piece of his mind that you've just destroyed all of the memories we know uh before becoming a lawmaker he was um, a movie actor an entertainer david do is stating right now all those memories i have in you in movies you've just ruined all of them you've destroyed all of them with what you are just then um, projecting We'll get a brief summary of what Desmond Elliott said in the House of Reps as he uh, warned celebrities and influencers. We'll bring that to you shortly. But before we do, guys, please, if you haven't given us a thumbs up yet, guys, do show us some love. Go ahead and give us a thumbs up. Click on the like button and don't forget to subscribe as well. Hit on the subscribe button. It really does mean a lot to us. Yes, we'll go straight into the news now and grab all of the details. Desmond Elliott is popularly known as one of the most successful male actors in the country. He has starred in many movies in the country and has big social media influence. After his acting career, Desmond Elliott is currently a politician and a speaker in the House of Representatives. Desmond Elliott was called to talk about the condition of the country in the House of Representatives. He said many things, including the negative impact of social media. He also warned celebrities and motivational speakers who are using their social media influence unwisely. He stated, The youth should be stopped from looting the private businesses across the country. These businesses are swept from their fellow human beings. My condolences to those who lost their lives in the Lekki massacre. What happened that day was tragic. Social media has a big negative impact. People are using it to fight the government in the country. Social media is doing more harm in the country. Celebrities, influencers, motivational speakers should take their time. These people should be careful about what they promote online. They have the medium to help and not to destroy the reputation of the government. Guys, I'll pause here first. I don't know what reputation um, Desmond Elias is, is talking about. I can see reasons why he got a lot of backlash. He's talking about reputation. Did they build any reputation for themselves? Anyway, let's carry on. Um, Desmond Elliott also stated, if these youths continue with their looting of properties, there will be nothing like Nigeria in the next five years. The youth should make things easier for the government. Wow. So that was what uh, um, Desmond Elliott actually stated that, that raised a lot of reactions, um, starting with David Doe actually stating that um, he has actually destroyed the good memories. You see what he's talking about, that um, the youth, that um, what um, people post online, they're trying to destroy the reputation. That's the one that got me, guys. I don't know if you know of any reputation that these are our leaders, they have built. I don't know, please. Maybe uh, I'm the one missing out here. But anyways, uh, um, yes, Davido has uh, Davido has taken again to his Twitter page again to speak up on Desmond Elliott's involvement in sponsoring a social media bill. The popular musician has not been happy with the former Nollywood star even since news came out that the veteran actor and movie producer a lawmaker representing Suru Larry constituency may be championing the establishment and conversation of social media bill to regulate and control hate speech and other forms of activities on the social media platforms. Many Nigerians, celebrities and well-known personalities alike have attacked him, with Davido especially expressing his disappointment. Taken to his Twitter recently, the firm Kruna posted, Desmond Elliot just destroyed all the precious childhood memories he gave us in movies. A lot of people are clearly not happy with the lawmaker and movie producer 
And in reaction to this, a number of people, his fans inclusive, could not also hide their feelings as they contributed their voice on Davido's post. Yes, yeah, so guys, um, Davido started all of this and stated that um, uh, Desmond Elliott just destroyed all the precious um, childhood memories very, very well. Um, yes, reactions are trailing. They are going on. One says here that um, the guy is a national threat. See how passionate he was while speaking nonsense. So guys, uh, we, the, right now, it's, <laughs> uh, Desmond Elliott is a lawmaker, someone representing uh, um, Nigerians. He's representing, he's a lawmaker um, in the House of Representatives. And what we're expecting is quite shocking what is coming out from his mouth. Taking sides with the government right now that uh, Nigerians should do well not to destroy the reputation of the government. They should stop looting. Guys, let's ask Desmond earlier. The, the palliatives, the, the COVID-19 palliatives that they, they are looting, how did they store them up in the first place? He's talking about people should stop looting. The looting has to stop very well first in that house of representatives. They are the ones that loot very well. Now. Imagine palliative that is meant for the whole country. They store them up for themselves. What is he talking about here? That uh, uh, if the youth continue looting and all of that, I see the reasons why Nigerians are really upset with him and they cannot understand why he's taking that turn. Who knows? Maybe because uh, as he has, he's gone into the midst of them, he has joined them. Now, the, the same corrupt set of people is already part of them and he looks like him. he's already dancing to their tune. Because he's taking sides with them. He's talking about a uh, um, Nigerian youth should stop the looting. But he hasn't addressed the problem of hardship. The problem of difficulty. Because trust me, if people have enough to eat in their houses, do you think they'll be looking for uh, where to go and um, carry um, COVID-19 rice? Or look for uh, those things that they carried away from the different warehouses? If they have enough in their houses, they won't do that. They don't have it. So he's not even addressing the main main thing. He's talking about uh, how the youth and this social media be is destroying the reputation of Nigerian government. You guys haven't seen anything yet. So you cannot shut Nigerians up. We will keep speaking. And guys, please, let's do it to continue sharing this news. This is really getting to them. They are looking for ways. Giving excuses that is social media that is bringing um, the escalating things and bringing the violence everything was seen meanwhile they are the cause of the problem bad governance we are still saying hashtag no to bad governance and bad governance we haven't changed our mind guys let's hear your own take thank you once again please if you haven't given us a thumbs up yet do go ahead and give us a thumbs up click on the like button and don't forget to subscribe as well hit on the subscribe button it really does mean a lot to us so i come your way again with more updates bye for now and god bless